Hello, and welcome to Language Portability Solutions video discussion of migration risks versus ROI. In this video, we will talk about some of the issues that senior executives need to understand as they evaluate strategies to lower overhead through reduced IT spending. Cost reduction through migration of mainframe systems to servers has been proven to be an effective means of lowering the cost of computing, but it does not come without risk. The Gartner Group estimates that mainframe migrations reduce the cost of computing anywhere from 40 to 70 percent. That's a powerful incentive. However, not all migration strategies are equally successful. We begin by examining the cost and risks associated with the three primary migration paths available to the enterprise. Perhaps the most conceptually appealing migration path involves simply moving the existing mainframe software portfolio to a server. Most legacy software is written in the COBOL language, and emulators exist that enable this software to run on a server. Because this path involves the least amount of transformation, it also involves the lowest cost and risk. However, it also accomplishes the least in preparing the enterprise for the twin challenges of changes in the workforce and what Gartner refers to as the nexus of disruptive forces, which we will discuss shortly. The challenge in the workforce centers on the fact that most legacy applications were developed over the last 30 years or more by baby boomers who are now entering their peak retirement period. New developers entering the workforce are not trained in COBOL and exhibit little interest in learning it. Not only that, but COBOL applications are not easily adaptable to new technologies, the nexus of disruptive forces, and this can threaten the competitiveness of the enterprise. At the opposite end of the cost-risk curve lies the path of re-architecting and rewriting the software portfolio. With this option comes a portfolio with a clean design tailored specifically to take advantage of modern technologies. This option certainly solves the twin problems of changes in the workforce and the nexus of disruptive forces, but it also carries the greatest cost and risk. To understand why, it is first necessary to understand that as the enterprise grew and responded to conditions in the marketplace, the application portfolio was being maintained and enhanced with little time and effort spent on documentation. That means that today, the only compilation of the business rules by which the entire enterprise operates is the code itself. During a re-architecting and rewriting process, someone has to extract those rules, document them, and then correctly apply them using a whole new programming paradigm. Unfortunately, experience shows that this approach rarely succeeds. The path to re-architecting and rewriting is littered with failed projects or projects that succeeded only after tremendous disruptions, cost overruns, and schedule slippages. No senior executive wants to have to explain to the board why the enterprise is five years into a three-year migration and has already spent twice the original budget. The final migration path, and the one that Language Portability Solutions offers, lies in the middle. Our technology is targeted to provide the maximum amount of modernization possible before the cost and risk accelerate to an unacceptable level. We use advanced analysis and compiler technology to automatically transform legacy COBOL applications into C-sharp with a degree of automation that exceeds 99.9%. This means that the existing business rules are automatically harvested from the legacy system and transformed into modern technology. Our migration path eliminates the risk associated with re-architecting and rewriting while delivering most of the benefits. First, the application has been transformed into a modern language and programming paradigm so that new developers entering the workforce can easily maintain and enhance the software portfolio. Second, because the application now uses the most modern technology available, the enterprise is now positioned to respond rapidly to the nexus of disruptive forces. At Language Portability Solutions, we have spent years developing and crafting our technology to ensure that following our migration path will leave the enterprise in a strong position to react to the nexus of disruptive forces, whether they come from social, mobile, cloud, big data, or some totally new technology currently being developed. This, in turn, will allow the enterprise to retain its competitive advantage as it reacts to the ever-changing requirements of the global marketplace. At the end of the day, in order to achieve the 40 to 70 percent reduction in the cost of computing that Gartner speaks of, an enterprise must choose one of these three migration paths. We have decades of experience in successfully guiding the transformation of enterprise software portfolios to achieve substantial cost savings. 
Thank you for viewing our discussion of migration risks versus ROI. We hope you have found it informative. For further information, please visit our website at www.cobaltocs.com or contact us at info at languageportability.com. Goodbye for now.